Welcome back. See, discussing how to create ideas and generate income. That takes me to another question. It says, what are the factors militating against ideas and creativity? Mm. Okay. Factors militating against ideas Idea and, and creativity. We have mentioned one of them, mm -hmm. our programming, mm -hmm. but you see, we cannot use that as an excuse mm -hmm. because even right in our environment, there are people who are making mm -hmm. it. Yes or no? Yes. Right. So you must tell yourself that you'll be one of them. Mm -hmm. Now, the other limiting factor is also still part of our culture. We find that our society, we have turned things on, on its head. Mm -hmm. We Now, instead of seeing money as something you get in exchange for value, mm -hmm. we see money as something that gives you value. value. So we worship money, as it were. We celebrate money, everything. Mm. Just make money. money, money, money Nobody money, wants money. to solve a problem anymore. Nobody is thinking, what can I do to improve, to improve the way people live? Which is what other people outside there do. The whole of the um, um, e-commerce, the whole of the digital marketing, mm. the whole of all the things that happen about Internet of Things, they are about solving problems, making life easier for someone, making things better, making it easier to do things, you know? If you don't think that way, you will not get ideas. Exactly. If, if you're focused on money, I want money, to make money, 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 you won't get ideas. That's one. Then number two is pressure. But you see, this one has this one is on the is, is, it has two sides because <laughs> pressure can make you get ideas. Pressure, pressure can also, also make you not get ideas. Exactly. <laughs> Why do I say pressure can make you get ideas? Because sometimes you get ideas on your own, but many times it's problems that drive you to ideas. Mm -hmm. Right? Take COVID again, for an example. Yeah, yeah. The COVID issue drove us to a lot of ideas. Yes. Ideas were flying everywhere. Innovative ideas, disruptive ideas. So the pressure that you're going through, you're running around, you know, things don't work. You have to even trust God for light, for basic need. Light, water, things that people don't think about in other places. Mm -hmm. So they put pressure on your mind. You are always struggling. You are trying to make ends meet. You are trying to, to, to pay your bills. And then you get into a rat race, you know, living from paycheck to paycheck. And then, you know, the unfortunate thing about rat races is that they say, even if you win, in the end, you're still a rat. <laughs> you know, so we cannot afford to remain in the rat race. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So that's pressure. Turn it to your good. Let the pressure push you to say, look, I cannot Pull continue to live yeah. like this. Mm. I'm not going to spend my whole life this way. Mm -hmm. And let it get you to take a break. Mm -hmm. When I say take a break. <laughs> thank you. When I say take a break, I'm not saying stop work. <laughs> it means that you find a time that works for you. It mm -hmm. could be any time of day. But thinking is something you must teach yourself to do. Yeah, so. Because that's the only way you connect with your inner self. Where that creativity is. You know, scientists tell us that, you know, the side of the brain that controls the idea generation is the frontal cortex. We all have it. But how many of, you, of us have developed it to the point where we can sit through, sit down with a problem, think through it until we come out with a solution? Because we're not trained to do like that. We're not trained to do like that from when we are small. A lot of us, our default setting is once you meet obstacle, you, you hands off. Mm. You give up. You throw mm. in the towel. But that is not the way to go. Turn That's pressure not. to be something that pushes you to your quiet zone where you sit down and say, you know what, I'm going to crack this thing. So the other thing that limits us about getting ideas is ignorance. Because what you do not know, you cannot aspire to, mm -hmm. right? So a lot of us, we have our smartphones in our hands and we use it to do all sorts of things. We use it to do everything but what is important. Mm -hmm. We use it to do everything else but, but what the is thing important. that is important. Because you know. in your phone with your data, you have access to the world. You have access to, to a lot of free trainings on Udemy, on Coursera. There are loads of things you don't know anything about today that in another, in another few weeks, you'll be, you'll be very knowledgeable in it. Knowledgeable enough to do a job for somebody mm -hmm. in that area. But, but because of ignorance, we don't, we don't do that. We focus on who is uh, on Instagram, who is doing this, who is slaying, who is that. Mm -hmm. And those things don't add value to us. So we have to reprogram ourselves. We have to change our mindset, mindset. and get onto the things that are important. That way you are, able to, to, you are able to do what you need to do to move yourself forward. So when I say get a good education, don't tell me my parents don't have money. Mm -hmm. If you have a smartphone and you have data, you, you can, can give yourself a good education. It doesn't have to be inside the classroom. Mm -hmm. Because, the, in fact, the education that helps us through life are not even the ones we get in the classroom. That's true. Right? Yes. So these are the things that limit us. You don't have to let it limit you because you are here today hearing these things we are saying. The other thing that limits people is leadership. A lot of people don't have a leadership figure 
to look up to. They don't okay, have someone. Mentor, somehow. Yeah, they don't have someone to mentor them. They don't have someone to look up to mm. because the system has disappointed a lot of oh, our youth. Yeah. That's the truth. Yeah. The system has disappointed them. You know, it's as if everybody is corrupt. Mm. But the truth is, there are still people, at least uh, uh, Elise is here. You know, there are still Hallelujah. people that you can look at, that can challenge you, that can inspire you to get to do things. Yes, so don't focus on the negatives. There are loads of them. If you want to focus on the negative, you won't get anything done. Let me be very honest with you. Because there's so much to complain about, so much to wail and moan about. But you tell yourself that in the midst of the same circumstance, there are people who are doing it. Mm. I want to be one of them. Mm. Mm. Make that promise to yourself today. Yeah. There are challenges, no doubt, mm. in life. In fact, life itself is a struggle. Life itself is a risk yeah. as well. But don't give up. Don't just remain just silent. Just don't, I beg, mean, I don't care. Anyone, anything I get, I just manage. Hey, start giving excuses. Where some people, they just grab it, opportunity, and move on with their lives. Those people, they don't have two heads. Of course, they have two heads, they have normal. And if you see anybody with two heads, you, you take on your heels. Yes. You know? So it's, a, it's just like you. One head you have, and, and, and again is that God gave each and every one of us the same 24 hours. So if you waste all your time, you have yourself to blame. The same 24 hours. No one has 28, no one has 20. 24 hours. Everywhere in the whole globe, not just only in Nigeria. So, 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 so that, that's it. So as a young one coming up now, think, think. Just sit down one place now, think. The thing is not for you to have a potential. The thing is for you, a positive one, not negative one. And you see that something good we really come out of it. We'll take a break now. Vivid view. See it and do it. This is Vivid View.